Hello everyone! We are finally here in Hawaii. It's our first time here. This is very exciting for us. We got a nice Airbnb and a nice car via Turo. We haven't explored anything yet except for Carlos who has been out the whole morning. I think the hardest part to get over is really jet lag. Right now it's 10. 30 in the morning in the Philippines and here over here it's around 4 p.m. Tristan hasn't even gotten up yet he's still sleeping I'm hoping that Carlos will wake up so that we can go out and explore a bit of the city yeah, so far it's been really good it's just the jet lag that we're trying to get over right now and we're really enjoying our Airbnb mini tour of our Airbnb this is our living area love that this is Aloha this is the kitchen basically where we eat our food. This is a really like charming, quaint place. Interesting is sleeping right there. It's nice and small, but it has everything we need. zoo today if the weather is going to be nice the whole day it's been and raining the, and there's a cow and he wants to see a cow and, and the zebra and the zebra and what else um kato eto what is um, kato eto it's eating the worm and the fish is living for the bit are you excited to go to the zoo yeah yeah me too love you Good morning! Oh, what did you see a while ago? What did you see? Ah? You scared me! I didn't scare you! What did you see a while ago? Out the window. I see the rainbow outside! Yeah, outside. We saw a nice rainbow. Mm. Is it door. still there? Oh, the rainbow. Do you have anything else to say? Mom, I'm the first day. Are you excited, Tris? Yeah! Where are we going? Look at that! Wow! Are the monkeys? It actually tastes like satangon as well. So it's like it's so similar to our very own Filipino food. Uh, I love the flavors. It's so fresh and it's like perfect for the beach. And now for the dessert. This actually looks like Maha Blanca and I tried it and it tastes like Maha Blanca. And this one, it looks like ube. And I bet you it tastes like ube. I forgot to open the lid and inside this is um, hoi. This is um, taro 
with water and it's kind of like a mashed potato. This is their staple to go along with the rest of their um, dishes. I, I just tried the poi and I don't like it. This is vinegar. Not a fan. It's kind of like bitter and uh, sour. But this is their staple apparently. So I guess you should try it if you're here. So you know how it tastes. Alright, we are on our way to North Shore to Lanikai Beach and we're very excited. <laughs> How do you like it, Lost? That was really good. Yeah. Pitos! Pitos here! This flies, there's a fly. Look at this tree, There you go. Guys, it. Is that what you do? I like it. Fire! There's always spiders here. Oh! How do you like the food? No poop! Poop poop! You like the fish? Fish is good, right? You eat it. You eat half. Whoa! Oh! <laughs> Look behind you. Is that the fish dance? You're doing the kato eto dance? No! Imagine how the Philippines would be if we were like this, if we had the same setup. That would be amazing. Just so you guys enjoying the beach in this long way. He refuses to get down from the stroller and just wants to eat his chips for this view. Waikili Premium Outlets. So, let's check it out. Kristen wants to go around. Come on, let's go. 
banana rep here, Saks Fifth Avenue off Fifth, Tommy Hill Figure, Calvin Klein. <laughs> hey guys, so today we are going to shoot with Sweet Escape and we're very excited. It's going to be a family shoot. Are you excited, Tris? No. No, he's not excited. Um, we're just waiting for the photographer. His name is Thomason. <laughs> and yeah, we're going to be shooting for about two hours. Oh, he's here. Yes. Hey Justin, how's He's it going? He's our photographer for today. Oh. It's for my vlog. <laughs> <laughs> So we are still shooting at the moment and I, I actually love the photographer, Tom. He's really good with Tristan and Tristan has been smiling the whole time and he's really enjoying this, surprisingly. He really doesn't like photos but today he's in a good mood. So we're lucky. aquarium today and oh my gosh we only have two more days here in Hawaii and we're kind of panicking because we want to spend every minute here having fun after this we're gonna go do more stuff and we're even gonna climb diamond head so that should be exciting is busy meeting up with her friends. Um, Tristan and I and Carlos, we've decided to go to a nearby beach and yeah, this place is called White Plains Beach. It's pretty chill here. Found a nice patch of grass. Okay, some ice cream. He, he wants ice cream so Carlos went out and got it for him. In the meantime, he's eating crackers. <laughs> Tomorrow is our last day our last full day in Hawaii so we really want to make the most out of this these last two days and bring so. your water yeah hey guys so we are stopped at the moment our car actually got a flat tire we rented this car via Turu um, this morning and it's a van it's a Chrysler van and we got a flat tire in the back rear and that's Carlos. He's trying to change it on his own and I can't help him because Tristan's with me and he's sleeping and breastfeeding. So, <laughs> such a hassle but uh, can we do? We have to change the tire. This is our last day in Hawaii by the way. So, I don't know if that means anything. So, how was it? How, how was it changing the tire? <laughs> It's okay. It's tiring. It's okay. Tiring. <laughs> the guy said it. Uh, the guy said this Chrysler is complicated. It's not that complicated. Actually, it's. Patalaga thanks. pag galing Pilipinas. Yeah, pag nice. sa Pilipinas. <laughs> what are you doing? Bringing up the tire. The spare. The spare is here in the front. Oh. In the middle. Okay. hiking to the top of Diamond Head and yeah Carlos is used to this sort of thing I'm not I'm not the athletic one but um, yeah it should be fun um, we've just begun uh, the hike and 
seems to be my kind of hike because it's paved all the way so it's a super easy hike as I was told but the view is spectacular Carla seems to be going at a much faster pace <laughs> but it's not about how fast you go but how far you can go non-athletic person like me made it so I guess you can too and the view here is spectacular my gosh it's really worth the hike right, we made it to the top <laughs> I'm going to have five burgers after this with lots of chips yeah. and maybe a pineapple. Oh my gosh, I did it. I can't believe it. I conquered Diamond Head and it feels amazing. I'm just glad it's over so I can eat. I love the trees. I love the air. I love the birds. I love nature. Then he goes, I love Dao's phone. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs>